It is that time of year when parents are desperately trying to get their kids registered for City of Toronto summer camps. There's madness at 7 o'clock in the morning on the days when they do open. Now, earlier on Breakfast Television, we had a chance to talk to one expert, one who's been through it all, Dina Pino, about what you need to do to try and get your kids into those much-wanted camps. It is a stressful experience every time. It's the meanest game and test your marriage and your family dynamic and ability to handle your panic-stricken kids who are like, oh, what? I'm not getting into that camp. If I don't, my life will be the worst ever. And you're like, really? Really? Did you have a fun scramble this week? It was madness as usual, and it's total mayhem, and it definitely tests your, your marriage and your family dynamic and your abilities to handle that computer under pressure. And, yeah, your kids are like, I better get in, I better get in. If I don't, like, what's going to happen in my life? And, you know, it's just camp in the end, but there's so much organization that has to go into mm -hmm. it for you to be able to handle it. What are some of the secrets to try and doing this? I mean, we hear okay. stories of programs being filled three, four minutes in. Yeah, once Roger, it you need to be organized. You need to be ahead of time, Toronto. You need to have a spreadsheet or some sort of document on a computer ready with every code, choices one through at least five, because you might not get your first choice. Mm -hmm. So codes ready uh, so that you can copy and paste them into the registration. That is key. And you also want to have uh, already been logged in so that it remembers your information your family PIN number, all the numbers for all, every family member, so you can just quickly pull them into the registration. You don't want to waste any time. So you do a lot of research before on you know, at least five you have lined up? Yeah, we have the entire week set up with, with five choices, at least five, sometimes more, um, because you're not necessarily going to get in that first that first choice. We got in this year uh, by pressing refresh, refresh, refresh on that login. It starts at 7 in the morning. Mm -hmm. uh, you see a countdown leading up to it and you start hitting login. By 7.08 we got in, which is phenomenal. Sometimes we've been a half hour. But at 7.08, one of the weeks was entirely booked of camp. So we didn't get into camps that week, and that's fine. We, we'll, we'll do other, other programming. But again, you keep the kids out of the way. You don't need them like bothering you and mm -hmm. pestering you. You need to be focused and uh, just get those codes in there. Great if you have a partner and you can like, if, you're, if your copy and paste isn't moving, ask to scream for the code. There's lots of screaming. Not your best representation of self during these moments. You need to video this, I think. I think we <laughs> just watch this whole thing. And you're still married, right? Still married. <laughs> Ooh, well, we got that going for us. Perfect. For more, go to our website, breakfasttelevision.ca.